Okay, I want to look at uh, some of the add-ins for Office 2013. Uh, in particular, Poll Everywhere. Uh, that's one of the nice things with Office 2013 is there's a lot of nice um, add-ins you can use. Um, what I've done is I've got just a simple slide I would use in my economics class, just some basic information on what causes um, shifts in demand versus a moving up and down the curve. Um, so if I cover this in class, and let's say I want to know, is to make sure students understand the difference between these two, I could ask a question. But what I'm going to do this way is I'm going to actually insert a poll directly into my slide. I'm going to go to this third slide real quick, and you'll notice over here under insert, you can see store, you can see my apps. When you click on the store, you can search or choose these apps that editors have listed and add those into your office products. Um, when I go to my apps, you'll notice I have poll everywhere, I have a QR code inserter, and then some different questioning things from Office Mix. So if I choose poll everywhere, it'll go in and I can uh, add and insert a new poll. And then I can insert that in. I did that on this slide. So here's one that I've entered. So here's a question. Which of the following cannot cause a shift in demand? Here are my four choices. So when I start my slideshow, so I cover this material with my students as we're going through. We come to this. I ask them to get their device. And then they can text that number 22333. And then they can send me, you'll notice what they do, they send my name and a number. So they're going to text that to me and then that joins them to the survey and then they text their choice. And when they do that, you'll notice it automatically updates the poll in class. So as you're going through uh, your presentation in class, you could insert poll everywhere into those presentations and get instant feedback from students live. So it's a pretty cool little feature. And literally I could go down here and I could do another one and I could have these multiple ones going through there and I just have to control the polls. But that's the uh, poll everywhere inserted into PowerPoint.